this is a quick overview of the tax rate feature. If you enable this, two things will happen. Firstly, this amount, which is detailed right next to the tick box, will start to be applied to the invoices that are sent to your freelancers. So if uh, previously I hadn't had this selected, so you won't see the tax listed here, but uh, let's go to a commission invoice. This is an invoice from you as a marketplace to your freelancers. Now, without the tax, you get the milestone information and you have the admin fee. With the tax enabled, a new line appears here, which looks just like this, tax, which charges the freelancer a tax at the rate that you specify here on top of the uh, commission that you're charging. So for example, let's say your commission is 10, uh, 10 and the freelancers just completed a milestone that's worth a hundred pounds and you're in the UK and you have to charge VAT at 20%. So the milestone was worth a hundred pounds. You're charging 10 pounds, uh, you're charging 10% commission and therefore your the invoice that you're sending to the freelancer is 10 pounds so 10 percent of 100 pounds that's 10 pounds but the vat is 20 percent. so instead of charging 10 pounds you're charging 10 pounds plus 20 percent of 10 pounds which is two pounds so then you'll be charging them 12 percent plus the admin fee rather than just 10 pounds so this figure here is the tax rate that you as a marketplace are going to charge to your freelancers. But it also does a second thing, which is that in the freelancer settings page, it creates a new tax rate section where the freelancer themselves, depending on which country they're in or whether they are or are not required to charge tax, they can add in their own figure here. I've set it to 20 because I'm basing this on a freelancer based in the UK that has to charge VAT. Now, if we go to a customer's invoice now, this is the invoice they've received from the freelancer who is charging a 20% tax rate. There's the milestone item here, which is worth three pounds in this case. And then there's the tax where they're charging, the freelancer is charging 20% of that three pounds, which is 60 pence. And then there's the admin fee. So there's a total fee of £3.85 in this case. And this obviously works across any country because the freelancer can just submit however much tax rate they want. And they can even change it if they like from invoice to invoice uh, every time before they submit that particular milestone. So that's how the tax rate works. You can toggle it on or off.